We begin tonight with Niagara officials and community members reacting to the death of Great Wolf Lodge's Keith Simmons. Yesterday, the popular tourism figure in Niagara died in a tragic accident, and some are reflecting back on his legacy. Jason Gaidola has more. He's known for his iconic howl and infectious spirit. Today, a community is mourning the loss of Great Wolf Lodge's Keith Simmons. He had something in him that made other people better, and including me. A frequent guest on CHCH Morning Live, our own Tim Bolin is reflecting back on the popular tourism figure today and remembers Great Wolf Lodge's general manager and vice president as charming and engaging throughout many segments over the years with him and camera operator Luke Gudgeon. It just, it hurts, man. Like, it, it just, it just, it just stinks. Ripley Entertainment confirmed Simmons' death today, telling CHCH News, the Jim Pattison Group, Ripley Entertainment Inc., and Great Wolf Lodge of Niagara Falls are deeply saddened by the loss of their passionate leader, Keith Simmons. We extend our heartfelt sympathy to Keith's wife, Toby, and his children, Ben and Nick. And Niagara Municipal Leaders also took to Twitter with the news. Niagara Falls Mayor Jim Diodati wrote yesterday, heartbroken to learn of the tragic accident this morning in which Keith Simmons lost his life. Condolences to his family, friends, and the Great Wolf Lodge Wolf Pack. Rest in peace, Mercer, you will be missed. St. Catharines Mayor Walter Senzig added, heartbroken, a real class act, he will be missed. Niagara Falls Councilor Wayne Thompson adds, Simmons is the face of Niagara Falls' most successful business. I just call uh, from the mayor and he told me that Keith Simmons has been killed by a vehicle. I am just shocked um, to hear this. Yesterday, just around the corner from the resort on the Niagara Parkway, Niagara police said a man was killed from a vehicle collision in the morning. The only traffic fatality reported yesterday. Witnesses at the scene said the man was on his bike when he accidentally fell onto the road and then was struck by a truck. Bolin saw Simmons as the brainchild in the resort's atmosphere and growth. He says he was also on the ground with guests, including Bolin's own family. The whole family, yeah. so I, I brought, I brought up Welcome the back to the lodge. <laughs> Keith Simmons, who is the... Uh, the I would bring the family for the experience at, at Great Wolf for the for the show. So then he gets to know he gets to know the kids and always asking about the kids and you can see would always he'd always be around and talking to people and and saying how you doing or having a good wolf time. Jason Guidola, CHCH News.